everybody welcome back to my channel yes it's nearly a week later and can you guess what I'm doing I'm gonna be changing my gear knob right so the plan is to swap this one out and as you would have seen in a previous video I kind of butchered it with my poor paint skills with the silver paint um, what I want to do is actually really restore it properly so I want to remove the silver redo the red and <clears throat> reapply it um, so in the meantime I've bought this online um, I didn't want to go too crazy and spend too much money because I just didn't so and a lot of them are very kind of different um, so yeah I've bought this it's a very simple it's metal nice weight to it and uh, it's got the same correct pattern as I say slightly smaller than my other knob but yeah I guess that's how things are today um, whereas everything else is getting bigger I think people prefer smaller knobs anyway so let's unscrew this one which is a basically I'm not going to milk this and do it for about 11 minutes um, it's come with some different inserts so there may be a bit of messing around um, and it will be interesting to see whether the splines line up so it's like that but in theory it should but you know how these things are so as per usual what I'm gonna do is remove the uh, gator off there now the more observant of you would have noticed there's not a um, lip on here for the gator but I'm gonna see if it stays there if not I'm gonna put a little cable tie on it but yeah I may fast forward this bit and play some music, or you can have the full glory of me turning my knob until I take it off of the, uh, the shaft. There you go. It's a lot of thread on these, in case you wondered. Um, it takes a lot of time. And I'll probably find... I can't remember what this is. Um, whether it's M12, I'm not too sure on the thread size, but... I should have looked it up really, shouldn't I? But I'm filming this before I go to work, so hence why I'm up early in the morning. Um, does it say in the bottom of there? No, not really. No, just some part numbers. Right, so this will be way too big, I believe, to go on there like that. So, as I say, it comes with these different inserts to put on so I'm going to work out which one it is and put it on right there's three different adapters and I think I I can't be sure I'm sure it's either M6 M8 and M10 or something like that but I'm going to go with the biggest one um, I believe it will go on that way which means that will be that way around so if I don't drop it and lose it in the car Let's have a quick look. Yeah, that's the correct size. So I'm going to wind that one down and then uh, obviously screw it on. Thinking about it, I think to keep the thread straight, I'm going to put it in the base of the uh, knob end and uh, do it that way around, like so. But I do hope that it keeps the splines right for on there, but we shall see. It does actually provide a little lip, doesn't it? So I may be able to put some kind of cable tie or tighten the thread on there, but let's just have a look first. There we go, all fitted, all nice and tight, and yeah, seem to line up perfectly, which is really good. Um, I'm just going to go and sort the gator out, as I say. I don't know whether to put its cable tie on the inside. Um, or whether I can actually pinch this bit up. Is there a bit of thread in there I can pull? It doesn't look so. I think there's meant to be a bit of elastic in there, but maybe over the years it's disappeared, so, yeah. Now, shall I have the 
gator at the base of the knob like that or just like leave it I like seeing a little bit of shaft I think that looks pretty good but yeah it feels all right actually weight feels good um yeah hmm let me think well, I've tried a few cable ties on it and pinching it up here, but it all just looks like the uh, thing is just like, I don't know, a bit weird. I've got some smaller ones, but, and I was going to thread it through the actual part here. But I think what I'm going to do, um, let's get a tiny piece taken out. Yeah, my missus is quite good with a needle and thread, so. But yeah, I mean, I don't even mind if it's like that. I mean, generally, it's um, it doesn't really go anywhere. But yeah, anyway, as I say, that was my um, £12 purchase, or £10 plus postage purchase, online from a well-known massive shop. Um, not the one that's, um, yeah, only a couple of letters. This is the one where the, uh, the owner builds spaceships, I think, something like that. Anyway, so whilst that's being used... I'm probably going to do a video about actually trying to do this correctly. As I say, it's a bit tired, but I don't know. Could make for an interesting view. But anyway, yeah, just to update you, like I say, it's not a full-length video. But as per usual, thanks for watching. And uh, feels a little bit race car, doesn't it? <laughs>